Overcast conditions left 134 Trekker monument disappointed. There was no ray of light at 12 midday to highlight the cenotaph. It said to symbolize God's blessings on the lives and endeavors of the four trekkers. Pre-94, the Battle of Blood River was commemorated as the day of the vow. So for us it's very important. Uh, that's why we have like a re reconciliation road between us and Freedom Park. Uh, reconciliation is one of the most important things. In Cape Town, an interfaith walk for reconciliation. The Dutch Reformed Church took part for the first time. Especially this time, what's happening over the world, we just um, want to ask people to forget about the extremists and stand, to stand together and getting to know each other. That's our message, I would say. The walk proceeded to the garden's shawl. It ended in the Boer Cup. God says, oh mankind, my creations, people, I made you. We created you from a single male and a single female. You all come from one mother and one father. In Northwest, some residents of Marikana and mine workers boycotted the event. The wounds of the 2012 massacre still raw. He says since the killing of his colleagues, nothing has changed. The incident was painful, but nothing stays the same forever. We're not yet relieved from this matter because those who died were our colleagues. But a call for unity. This thing that there are people who are saying they have not yet reconciled with others who may have harmed their families, who may have contributed to what they perceive to be an onslaught of their families, it's not surprising. If you go anywhere in South Africa, you will find some people who are still bitter. In the Southern Cape, cultural groups celebrated their diversity. We believe it is time that we put the apartheid legacy behind, uh, stand in the footprints of Madiba and Nelson Mandela to take this area forward. We need to gather as people and make a difference in the lives of everybody in this district. And that's what is critical. In Kimberley, time out at the poolside. Today is um, Reconciliation Day. Ne? So we are here to have fun with friends, uh, people that we've been longing for. We are here gathered with our family and friends, having a nice time. Some people we have seen them like since January because we've been away. So today, it's the day that we meet together and celebrate. Celebrations, but amid warnings not to overuse alcohol. Lehana Tsutiti, SABC News.